Hey guys, how's it going? So, uh, it looks like AMC Apes are losing. They're losing the war between, uh, I guess, market manipulators and short sellers over, uh, you know, retail investors. I honestly believe that retail investors never really had power in the first place. I believe that the manipulation of AMC stock to $60 is mixed with uh some hedge funds and institutional investors and um now they are shorting the stock and manipulating the price towards the downside and i did make a video a week ago saying that i believe that amc stock is heading to 15 dollars and uh it's starting to come turn true so we'll see what happens in the coming days and weeks but uh AMC right now is completely is basically a falling knife at at like right now. So we'll see. I mean there might be some bounces along the way, but I still think that we're heading down to fifteen dollars. That's my opinion. Then we look on Adam Aaron's page. Uh he's the CEO of AMC. He says that we are we have now have more than five hundred thousand members of the AMC Investor Connect, so they're giving away five hundred thousand of these I own AMC stock tokens, and uh, you know I didn't sign up, and I don't actually have any AMC stock, but five hundred thousand members and AMC stock keeps going down. I think AMC has way more than five hundred thousand investors, though. I think they have like millions of investors. And millions of investors are losing against hedge funds and institutional investors that are shorting and manipulating the stock price towards the downside. It's funny how I said that AMC stock is connected to Bitcoin. Bitcoin had a big crash today. And what happened to AMC? AMC stock had a big crash today. Big crash this morning. Bounce. You know, and then just kind of traded sideways all day long. Uh, we'll see what happens in the weeks, but I I feel like it it might go back to like twenty five, twenty six dollars. But I still feel like you know it's still downtrending, and I I still feel like we're gonna see you know fifteen dollars eventually. That's my opinion, and none of this is financial advice. So you know, I might be completely wrong. We'll see what happens. Uh, Bitcoin, uh, Bitcoin, yeah, I already talked about crypto.com, uh, looking really nice. Uh, I'm hoping this thing goes to like 40 cents and then I'll start buying back into my, uh, into my crypto. My Crow, uh, VGX, I'm hoping this thing goes down to like $2 so I can start buying it back at $2. Rose Token, uh, I hope this thing goes back to like 20 cents. Well, that would be nice. Uh, I can start loading the boat on that. So yeah, anyways, and then Tesla today, you know, under a lot of pressure, and after hours, still under a little bit more pressure. Uh, I I I made a prediction this morning. I think Tesla is going to hit around eight hundred dollars, maybe even go lower. Who really knows at the end of the day? But that's what I think will happen. Uh, in the in the short term, you know. But I could totally be wrong, and uh, you know, this could be a buying opportunity. I. Personally, would not buy that out right here. I think it's a falling knife. But that's my opinion. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you don't want to, that's okay. I don't care. And have a great day. Bye.